Hi everyone, it's Shavaya Loves Makeup, and in this video I'd like to do um, a review of a line of skincare products for, uh, for eye treatments. And my issues with uh, my eyes are I have aging, issues regarding aging skin, so um, fine lines. I have obviously puffiness, especially here, and well here too, you can tell fine lines and wrinkles underneath my eyes, um, these little baby wrinkles that you get here, just the basics with that come with aging. And so I've tried every, not every eye cream, but you know, a lot of us as we age have tried a multiplicity of products to try and do a multiplicity of things, okay? Uh, take care of bags, puffiness, wrinkles, crow's feet. Um, I think that's part of the problem is that Eye creams that tout to do everything, don't do that. They can only do so much. So in my experience, retinol-based eye treatments, they're really good uh, for tightening and for firming, but they do nothing for dryness. You know, they're not made for that. And also, retinol-based eye creams, in my experience, are very irritating. Um, the next day... Um, I'll wake up and if I use any sort of a moisturizer with some ingredient that is irritating, it will burn my eyes so badly that I feel I find that I have to be really careful with eye treatments. So I've come I've discovered a line that works for me, but I have to use several different products of it, of this line, from this line, to do several different things. So the first, the, the line is Shiseido, and uh, a lot of uh, beauty YouTubers here talk about Shiseido. Uh, Coco LaRue, I, I want to give her credit because she talks really well, um, very thoroughly about Shiseido and the line. She's very knowledgeable about it. She's the one that really turned me on to the line. I used to think it was too cost prohibitive, but honestly, it's really so good. And it's one of those lines that... Um, are like clinical, you know, almost like almost clinical in terms of treatments, but also luxurious because the packaging is always so luxurious. Um, I know you're paying in part for the packaging. It's so beautiful. If there's a fragrance, it is just perfect. I mean, just not too heavy, but slight enough. And I ser seriously don't think that the fragrances in any way um, are uh, have a negative effect or impact on the skin. I think they are just contributory to the whole luxury experience of taking care of your skin. So I would buy more Shiseido products if I could afford them, but I primarily use them for their eye care line. So this is the Shiseido Benefiance Concentrated Anti-Wrinkle Eye Cream. Whoa, yeah. So I'm almost out of this. I'm sorry, I don't know any of the prices of these. I get them on Amazon as cheaply as I can. Again, not the most expensive out there, but somewhere mid-range in terms of, you know, luxury items. This is not an anti-wrinkle cream, for, in my experience. This is, it says anti-wrinkle cream, but the Benefiance line, so Shiseido has all these different lines. White Lucent is for hyperpigmentation. Benefiance is for dryness or aging skin. Uh, so Benefiance, this is such a rich cream. Um, I'm, oh, I'm almost out, but you can see you've got to dip your finger in there. It's very, very rich. It's emollient. It's for dry, dry eye areas. That's what it's for. I don't feel like it does anything for wrinkles. So the nights that I use retinol on my face, I will be sure to use a like a barrier almost around my eyes and here and way, look way up and get underneath here where the very, very fine lines are using this. Benefiance is, again, very gentle never gotten it in my eye but it gets very very close to my eye and it never irritates so I find this to be for hydration um, as a barrier I find it to be very helpful that's what I use it for and I use it at night uh, the second one I used to use this during the day um, I'm using something else right now but I think I'll incorporate this back with this second product I'll show you this is the <clears throat> Shiseido bio performance that is Shiseido Bio Performance. 
Super Eye Contour Cream. Okay, this one was highly touted on Makeup Alley. Um, it's a lighter, it's not as rich as the Benefiance. Everything from Benefiance is going to be very rich. It's light. Um, and this is supposed to help with fine lines and wrinkles. Yeah, it, it, it seems to help. Doesn't seem to do any, and that's not a miracle in a bottle by itself, but I do like it. Um, it's, I don't know what, it's just the bioperformance line. There's other bioperformance products. And I like it. I don't like the packaging because you can't tell how much you have left. And um, again, I don't think it's a miracle in a bottle. It does nothing for puffiness, under eye puffiness for me. Absolutely nothing. Uh, but this does. And I'm not using it right now. Otherwise, I would be a walking advertisement for it. But I'll, I'll put it on one day and let you know that I'm wearing it and ask if you can see a difference. It's this. Shiseido. Excuse me. Shiseido Benefiance Nutri Perfect Eye Serum. And I don't see this talked about much on YouTube. This was fairly expensive. It's a serum, so it's a treatment. And um, it morning and night, it says, gently massage into eye area. Um, on Makeup Alley, people that have used it have said that they have found it to be um, good as a serum, but not enough as an eye cream, so it's not moisturizing enough on its own. I use it during the day and I find it to be moisturizing enough on its own. I have dry skin and I've just been using it on its own to see how effective it is by itself. This, I feel like when I get way up under the eye area and I save this because it's so expensive, I use it very um, sparingly. I use it during days that I go to work, um, just honestly. I don't use it during the weekend because I feel like I want to save it for when I need to look my best at work. And I feel like it really does work on tightening these these fine line areas under the eye um, and around here, uh, laugh lines. I have seen a difference. Now, the puffiness, no. <laughs> I can't, nothing, a little bit, perhaps, a little bit, yeah. Um, and again, this is just very anecdotal, obviously. I don't have a before and after picture, but this is, these are just my my visceral reactions to this product so i like it it's doing something it is working i can feel it tighten after you put it on you can feel this work actually as opposed to something like the benefiance you don't feel really feel anything i feel this firming it doesn't seem to dry out my skin but now i'm going to incorporate both of these together um, let this sit in and then apply this uh, the bio performance eye cream and hopefully that will be a nice um, pairing and that will really help the eye area for me. So those are just some products I wanted to share with you that I'm using for um, aging skin um, around my eye area. So if you have any questions, comments, or feedback, please let me know if you've used any of these products, especially the serum, which I don't find much information on. Also let me know. So thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.